This tutorial is powered by AskQuesty.com. Get help with your website on demand. And don't forget, subscribe for more tutorials. In this video, I'll be showing you how to create a shortcode button in WordPress. So the first step is to open up your WordPress website and click to navigate to the dashboard. Then head over to plugins on the bottom on the left hand side and scroll to the top and click add new. Search for the max button plugin. So uh, it says WordPress button plugin max buttons. You want to install now. And after installing, click activate you'll know that this button is successfully added when you see max buttons here in plugins as well as this orange icon on the left so click on max buttons and you want to add a new button okay so to add a new button first you want to give a button name that will be helpful so let I will just call this a free LinkedIn guide. Okay, and the URL will be the link. Uh, will be the link of the button. So in this case, I want to give I want to give the person that clicks on the button a free LinkedIn guide. So I'm going to navigate to students uh, dot LinkedIn and. Here's a PDF that I can provide them. Okay, so I copy that link and I paste it into the URL. And over here on the top right is the preview of the button. So here it says your text. And you can change that to whatever text you want. In this case, I'll do get uh, my free LinkedIn guide. Okay, and then button tooltip. I'll put in a, uh, a tip, like a hint of what the button does. That way, when someone hovers over the button, they see it says a free LinkedIn guide for you. So you can change this to whatever you want. So come uh, part one of LinkedIn uh, series, for example. You, if you put something like that, you hover over, it'll say part one of LinkedIn series. And you can change the font as you wish, as well as the background color. Uh, I will just, for the most part, just leave it as is. But you may want to customize the text color hover, as well as the all these, uh, all the colors to match your, uh, to match your theme, to match your branding. So after you've customized the button, you can now click save. So I'm going to hide the preview and click on buttons tab. So on the buttons tab, you see that there's a, there's a short code that's provided to you. You can either use the max button ID uh, short code or the one on below. I will just use the one on top. It really doesn't matter which one you choose. So I copy the short code and then I head over to pages and go to a page where I want to place my button. On the new offer page, uh, I'm using new offer. You can do whatever page you want. I'm going to paste the short code and then I click preview. And here it says, get my free LinkedIn guide. Uh, over here, you see the text is kind of overflowing a bit. You can within the, within the max buttons plugin, uh, you may want to change the, the size of the button so that it doesn't look as ugly as this. Or you may want to lessen the number of words. So then that way, if if it only said get my free LinkedIn, it would be shorter and it wouldn't have the word guide that that doesn't fit. So you might want to customize this so it looks a little better. But for the most part, this is how you create a button. And when you click on the button, it brings them to your your free guide or your free resource, your video or what, whatever you're providing uh, uh, with your button. And don't forget after you 
place your button to click the update tab on the top right to make your changes permanent. So that is how you add a short code button to WordPress. I hope this video helped. Thanks for watching. If this was helpful, please subscribe. And if you need extra help, visit askquesty.com and send us your questions.